Hello everyone, this is Al Red Sox Fan coming to you from Al Red Sox Fan YouTube channel. Hope all is well. And we'll continue with Franchise Manager 8, 1978-80 Hartford Whalers. They travel to Buffalo to take on the Sabres. Um, we're continuing to use the player icon mod. Link provided on the page and in the chat to download uh Instead of squares, you can have little players. Let's get to the game. Again, it's just gameplay. I do the other stuff, which we mostly let the computer handle um, offline. The Whalers, we're 3-0. and I've won three games. We have six points. The Sabres are 1-2-0. and They have two points. Let's get to the game in Buffalo. And you can see the player icons to the top. And again, we will be playing as the Hartford Whalers. And I play, um, I'll show you the way, I love it. I love the chalkboard, the way they've done it. They got to tweak it just a little bit. I got the names to show up. Thanks to Christopher Slovic. Big shout out to Christopher Slovic. Please check out his channel and subscribe. He's the one who showed the player mods for the first time. And he answered a lot of my questions during one of his live games. He was kind enough to stop and answer questions. Um, so check it out. Uncle Dave Gardner's joined us. Check out that wonderful channel. He had some Stratomatic football on earlier today. Check it out um, as he's learning that game. And he says, I have, I, I got to figure out how to put in those little guys. Very easy. Very easy. Well, it is, I can do a quick little video uh, and show uh, uh, this week. All right, so let's get to the gameplay. Uh, earlier today, a little while ago, we did a Glory Days Boxing. Card and Dice makes everything nice. Check out Glory Days Boxing on sidelinestrategies.com. Created by our good friend Anthony from Bleacher Bums Gaming. We had uh, Joel Lewis taking on Deontay Wilder. It was a fun, wild matchup. Aha! How do you get the names? You have to do it in the settings at the beginning of the game. I'll show that after, too. <clears throat> Excuse me. So we're going to go to options. This is the way I like to play. We're not going to play very fast. Oh, no, that's if we sim it. We're going to play on normal speed. It's the way I like to play. Full. And then I like to do use on ice decisions. It's really cool. It's almost like action PC, but s different. So it's really cool. I like it. And this is the part of the game I love what they've done. Um, You know. To me, again, it's just me because I don't play it enough, but I'm going to play it. I'm playing it more because I enjoy this. I'll get used to the other parts of the game. I don't think I'm going to make any trades. I might try to get Esposito, Phil. I don't know. So that's it. So now let's go play. And here come the little dudes. And we got the names. You can see them. I wish I could make them bigger, though. But we do have the names on the players now. And I actually downloaded... Um, the actual whalers. They made whaler uniforms. Though I think I still have the wrong goalies. Yeah, I do. I have to f switch that. But that's okay. They're green. <laughs> so our starting five are Hodgson, Howe, Stoughton, Rogers, and Bennett. For the... And if we go to... So there's a face-off. The Sabres win it. They take it into the Whalers' zone. Oh, offsides, offsides. Rogers wins the face-off against Peralt. This is what I like. So we're in control. I'm going to hit wait. Mark Howe's in control of the puck. We're going to wait. We're going to look for a better option. Howe slides the puck to Bennett. We have Bennett on the wing. Bennett, <clears throat> pretty decent skater, but he's on the wing, so I like that. We're going to let him skate. So Bennett takes a bit to the middle. As Stoughton goes out to the wing, Bennett gains the zone. They haven't stopped Bennett. Bennett continues to skate. Now he slides a beautiful pass to Stoughton. Now, we can go no choice and let Stoughton make his own decision. He's a little difficult to coach. So he's probably not... I want him to shoot. I'm going to click shoot, but he might pass. We got Rodgers here. You know what? Let's let him make his own decision. Rodgers has put in... I think we've scored six goals with Rodgers so far. So no choice... He takes it to the net, and he puts a shot on Edwards. Edwards freezes it face-off in the Sabres zone. Sabres win the face-off. 
trying to get it out of their zone. Whalers with decent pressure. Now Perrault coming down the wing. Perrault gains the Whalers zone. Perrault waits. And he's offsides. They're offsides. I think it was offsides to the top. Faceoff one by the Whalers. Puck goes to Rogers. I love Rogers. I'm going to let him shoot. Rogers scores! Yes! Beats Edwards. Stick side, lower bottom of the net. Unbelievable. Assisted by Blaine Stoughton. Rogers is having an incredible start to this season. Jason Cull is here in Buffalo for the Whalers and Sabres. So face off at center ice. 19-0. Whalers score quickly once again. Face off at center ice. Keon to take the face off. Keon wins the face off, sends it to Gordy Howe. Whalers in control. Howe, very coachable. And Gordy will skate. Still tremendous at this age. Howe skates it into the zone. He, they're double teaming Howe. Howe slides the puck to Keon. Keon has a uh, you see the goal, he's got him pretty well covered. Keon is gonna we're gonna go pass. Keon slides it over to Harold Filipoff. Filipoff does not have a good angle. He is going to wait for a better positioning. Now he sends it over to Gordy Howe. Howe. Ooh, we've got that side of that net open. Come on, Gordy. Gordy puts a shot on that. Save by Edwards. Sabres control the puck as they come up ice. Sabres gain the Whaler zone. Put the shot on. Save. Puck is loose. Knocked back towards Garrett. And Garrett makes the save again. Jason Cull says... Wow, the game has improved a lot. I love that I can play it. I can. I like that I can control the little players. That's my favorite part of this game. Face off in the way. Oh, no, no, no. No face off. He didn't freeze the puck. He sends... Garrett sends the puck to Hodgson. Hodgson, I like to play weight here. Hodgson now fires it out to Filipov. We get it out to the wing. He's going to... He's somewhat coachable. I want him to skate. And he skates it up ice. Gains the saber zone. Still puck handling. Now he waits. Skating it around, looking for an opportunity. Breaks it towards the net. A lot of traffic in front of Edwards. Phillips playing with that puck a little too long. He's going to lose it. Now he sends it to Roberts behind the net. Roberts near the boards. Ooh, we have Keon here. Roberts... Is somewhat coachable. We'll let him make his own choice. Roberts on the boards. Sends it out to Mark Howe. Not a lot. The angle's horrible here. You can see Ramsey. I can't read that. I think that's Luce. And Scofield. I wish the, n the names were bigger. I have trouble reading the names. So he, Rogers. I'm sorry. Mark Howe's going to wait. Let's get some. It looks like there's a line change. Oh, he puts the shot on net. Blocked. By the Sabres. Sabres in control. Whalers putting pressure on the Sabres in their zone. Stouten on Ramsey. Ramsey sends a beautiful outlet pass to Luce. Luce. I can't read the name. Back to Luca. Luce. Let's pause it for a second. Shot on it. Saved by Garrett. Let's see who that was. For I can't read the names. They're kind of, uh, Luce. L-U-C-E. I think it's Luce. Saved by Garrett. He's been really good in that for us. Let's see if he froze the puck. Nope. Garrett sends it out to Roberts. So next to him, Roberts has the puck near the net. Roberts will pass. Roberts sends it out to the wing on Stoughton. I like. I want Stoughton to skate. Jason Cole, Al, do you find the game realistic? I'm not the hockey expert. I find it fun. <laughs> That's important to me, fun. And it's an open engine. Uh, I mean, an open world. This is, you know... Uh, franchise manager hockey, same sort of engine like out of the ballpark baseball. You can't play it straight up. They don't have just seasons like they do in baseball. You have to, you know, you can make trades. Like I said, I might try to get Phil Esposito. I don't know. So Stoughton's on the wing. He's going to skate. Stoughton brings it up the wing. Sabres getting back on defense. Stoughton crosses the red line. Now they're going to play dump and chase, line change for the Whalers. Sabres get there first. Cor Corab has it. Does he still have the puck? I don't know who has the puck now. Oh, Peralt has it over here. And it looks like they're just waiting to set something up. He who hesitates lost. 
Sabres killing a lot of time in their zone. We got them befuddled. Peralt having a brain fart, it seems. Now Peralt sends the puck to somebody. He plays it back. Now Peralt gets it back, and here comes the attack by the Sabres. Peralt gains the zone, being double teamed by Howe and DeBull. Peralt sends it out to Murdoch. Murdoch being harassed by Howe. Excellent job by the Whalers, not giving the Sabres any room to breathe. Howe really disrupting Murdoch. Murdoch needs to do something here. He's going to lose that puck soon for the Sabres. Howe all over Murdoch. A lot of stick checking there. Murdoch, fiddles, diddles, Sabres really playing a slow offense. Oh! Who's got the puck? I don't even Oh, no, it goes back to Murdoch. Murdoch being double teamed, trying to take it to the net. Shot on net, saved by Garrett. That was a slow setup by the Sabres, but they got a shot in tight on Garrett. Garrett makes the save. He's going to play it out to Rogers. Rogers has the puck. And we'll let Rogers make the decision. Rogers sends it out to Roberts on the wing. Roberts is somewhat coachable. We'll let him make his own choice. Rogers starts to skate it towards center ice. Whalers looking to gain the zone. Rogers shoots. Saved by Edwards. Rebound to the Sabres. Sabres look for the quick breakout, and they have it. Down the wing comes McGregor. I don't know. Back to McGregor. Give and go. Smith has it. Smith. Oh, Gordy Roberts, two-minute minor interference, as that was a good pass to Smith. Looked like he was going to put a shot on Garrett. So, the Whalers will be on the penalty kill. And there's Roberts. He goes to the box, lower portion of the screen, face-off. Whalers win the face-off. Getting the puck is Mark Howe, and we will ice it, as we're going to clear the zone. Sabres will have to start their power play all over again. Here come the Sabres. Quickly up ice. Sabres play dump and chase. Whalers get to it first, it seems. No, it's going to be a battle along the boards. And once again, oh, they're going to call icing. Icing is called. Face off. Sabres lose the puck. Horrible play by the Sabres on dump and chase. Whalers will get there first. And again, it's icing. So the Sabres are pissing away this power play. Sabres in control. And again, the Sabres. <laughs> Jesus. No wonder they've only won one game. Another icing. Sabres are on the power play. This is the world's worst power play. Perot and Keon. Sabres win it. Sabres, minute five left and counting on the minor for interference to Roberts. Roberts sits in the box. Sabres lose the puck. Excellent poke check by Gordy Howe. Gordy Howe's in control. He's going to skate. How shorthanded, taking on the Sabres, crosses the red line, crosses the blue line, playing towards the net. How killing off the penalty, sends it to Keon. Keon will shoot, hopefully puts the show oh, just wide of Edwards. Puck goes behind the net, a battle for the puck. Sabres have it, 24 seconds left on the power, and the Sabres, that is the worst power play you will ever see in history. Another icing, 17 seconds left. Line changes for both teams. Rogers kicked out of the face-off circle. Stoughton comes in against Peralt. Stoughton wins it. Short-handed. He'll play it back towards Lee. 12 seconds left on the power play. Lee towards the blue line. Lee will pass. Lee sends it. Oh, to Stoughton. Stoughton will shoot. This is still short-handed. Stoughton's going to shoot. Saved by Edwards. Battle for the puck won by the Sabres. Teams at full strength as Roberts comes out of the box. Sabres play dump and chase. Howe gets there first. Good job by Mark Howe. Howe controls near the boards. Howe will try to get a pass off here. And he does to Stoughton. Stoughton. Hopefully we can get a pass to Rogers. Stoughton, a little difficult to coach. We'll go, we'll give him his own choice. Stoughton skating it up ice, not wanting to give up the puck because he's a greedy bastard. Stoughton gains the zone, sends it across to Roberts. Roberts is going to wait, hopefully, and let's see if we can get Rogers right in the middle. So we're going to wait with Roberts. He sends it back to Stoughton. I want Rogers again. He's going to wait. We're going to set up a better opportunity, hopefully. 
Stoughton being harassed. Give and go back to Roberts. Now it looks like we got a line change here for the Whalers. I'm going to have Roberts put the shot on net. Saved by Edwards. Sabres controlled. Breakout. On the wing comes Ramsey. Ramsey being harassed. Plays dump and chase. Puck goes around back of the net. Al Sims gets there before Sealing. Or Sealing. It's tough to see the names. I wish the names were bigger. Uh, let's just go to the here real quick. Oh, I can't. It's over here. Sealing. It's Sealing. Okay. For the Sabres. So Al Sims has it. If we wait, we're going to get... You know what? Let's let Sims make the choice. Sims sends it down. Whalers... Oh, that's going to be icing. God, fudge knocker. That's icing. And it's icing. All right. Bad decision by Al Sims. Face off in the Whalers zone. Lacroix loses the face off, but the Whalers win the battle for the puck. Coming away with it is Marty Howe. Marty Howe is going to skate it out of the zone. Here comes Marty. Marty... Waiting, fiddling, diddling. Whalers setting up some sort of offense, trying to catch the Sabres off guard. Now sends it to Mark. So we have Marty, Mark, is and Gordy Howe. We have the Howes all on the ice. This is awesome. He's going to pass back to Sims. Sims passes out to Gordy Howe. Gordy Howe's on the wing. Old man Gordy's going to skate. He's picking up speed. He crosses the red line. He gains the Whaler zone. He's looking for one of his sons. How being defended by Ramsey. How taking it to the net. How can't be denied. Now he skates a spin a do. Turn around. How still taking it behind the net. Now he shoots save. And Edwards covered it up. Face off won by the Sabres. Sabres control the puck. I'm trying to figure Oh, so McK now they play it back. Sabres coming up ice. Sabres shoot, score! Oh, that was a quick attack. I think Peralt got the goal. We'll find out in a moment. It was Peralt. I was correct. Assisted by McKegney and Heich. H-A-J-T. Heijit? Bill Heijit? So it's 1-1 with 9.29 to play in the first period. As Dave Gardner's playing a little second season football, he says, how is that possible? Spelling how as the last name of Gordy Howe and Marty Howe and Mark Howe, H-O-W-E. So it's 1-1. Remember, the Whalers are 3-0, and and hopefully our O doesn't go. Face off one at the center ice by the Whalers. Puck gets knocked to Bill Bennett. Bennett will wait. Bennett now skating around, being harassed. Oh, a nice pass to Rogers. Rogers is on side. Rogers is going to skate it in. Rogers trying to split the Sabres defense. Now sends it out to Stoughton. Stoughton will wait. Bill Height, thank you. So Stoughton's going to wait. Look to set a better opportunity, but he's being harassed. Puts a shot towards the net. It's blocked. Sabres in control. Breakout by the Sabres. Sabres on the wing. Sims harassing Peralt. Now giving go back to... I can't read that gentleman's name, but they lose the puck. Sims and Bennett basically Malachi crunched. Let's see if we can get the name here. I think it was Gar. Again, I wish the names were bigger. But good job by the Whalers defense in this 1-1 hockey game with 8.27 to play. Pass goes to Stoughton. Stoughton's going to skate. He's a good skater. Stoughton, a bit slow. Now he's picking up speed. Crosses a red line. Dump and chase as it looks like it's going to be a line change for the Whalers. Sabres have it. Korab sends it to the middle. Korab sends it to, I think it's Gar. Gare, Gar, yep. Gare in possession. Gare down the wing. Dump and chase for the Sabres. Whalers will get there first. Marty Howe gets to the puck. Gare lining him up. Smith lining him up. We're going to go with a quick pass, hopefully, and a breakout. Howe sends a beautiful pass to Filipov, and Gare is trying to get to him. Filipov is going to try to skate it out of the zone, and he does. So Filipov... Crosses center ice, gains the Sabres zone, being harassed by Height. 
He has Keon behind him. Let's see if he can slide the pass to him. Keon going to the front of the net. Filipov spins and his shot is blocked, but he maintains possession of the puck. Filipov now slides it to Keon. A lot of traffic here. Bad angle. We're going to go pass. Plays it to Filipov between two Sabres defenders. Can he thread the needle with the shot? Save by Edwards. Puck is loose. Face off won by the Sabres. Quick outlet pass to ceiling. Ceiling flying down, and he is poke checked. But now the puck goes to Smith. Smith puts the shot on Garrett. Garrett makes the save. Did he freeze the puck? No, he doesn't. He quickly slides it to Mark Howe. Howe looking for the breakout pass. Sends it a beautiful pass to Antonovich. Antonovich will skate it down the wing. Sabres getting back on defense. Defense. Antonovich puts the shot on Edwards. He makes the save. He freezes the puck face off in the Sabres zone. Rogers loses the face off to Lucic. Sabres have it. Murdoch in possession. Sabres looking to set up their offense. Continue to skate around. Now they have the breakout. Murdoch with the puck. Whalers retreat defensively. Pass. Dudley back to Murdoch. Murdoch to Dudley. Dudley being harassed by two defenders. They're trying to get the puck to Luchas in the middle, but they can't. Murdoch trying to crash the net. Defended by Sims and Rogers or Roberts. It's Roberts and Sims harassing Murdoch behind the net. Trying to get that puck. Oh, he's able to put a shot. A weak shot on Sims. Actually, the shot was blocked. Al Sims in possession. Sims will try to pass. He sends it out to Bennett. Bennett hopefully will skate it out of the zone. Sabres, we're in a 1-1 game. Bennett gaining speed. Gains the Sabres zone. Harassed by Stewart. Bennett now here. Oh, they're double teaming Bennett. Peralt comes down trying to take that puck. They're trying to drive Pennant into the boards. Bennett needs to get rid of this puck. Come on, Bennett. Come on, Bill. Get rid of the puck. You're going to lose it. Sabres putting a lot of pressure on Bennett, trying to keep him pinned in on those boards. Bennett fighting hard with that puck. Bennett needs to get a pass out of here. He is in trouble, but he is fighting off the two defenders for the Sabres. Peralt and Stewart. Now Bennett. Oh, a pass. What a beautiful pass through the crease. To Gordy Howe, tough angle, but Howe's going to shoot. Save by Edwards. Long rebound goes to Sabres. Uh, Gare coming down ice against, I believe that's Mark Howe. He puts a shot on Garrett. Garrett with the save, the rebound. Whalers, and it's Hodgson. Hodgson, well, maybe we can get it to, I believe this is Gordy Howe, lower portion of the screen. And he sends it instead to Mark Howe. Mark Howe now plays it. Back to Hodgson. Looks like the Whalers are going with a line change here. We're going to wait. And it is a line change. Hodgson plays it behind the net. He's being harassed. Now he sends the pass out to Gordy Howe. Old man Gordy picks up some head of steam. Gordy, past the red line. Gains the Sabre zone. Ramsey and Schofield harassing Gordy Howe. Gordy Howe, beautiful pass to Antonovich. He's going to put a shot on, hopefully. Shoots! Save by Edwards! A rebound goes to the Sabres. Lucic sends it out to Gare. Gare down ice. Gare gains the Whalers zone. Shot on Garrett. Save. Whalers control. Another shot on Garrett. Another save. Did Garrett freeze the puck? No, he doesn't! Stolen by Ramsey! Ramsey! Oh my god! Two to one Sabres. Sloppy play by the Whalers. Ramsey picked I believe it was Robert's pocket. Garrett made the initial save. The rebound went back to Ramsey, and he put the backhand into the back of the net. 2-1 Sabres with 3.06 to play in the first period. Dave Gardner, Uncle Dave Gardner. Remember, check out that YouTube channel. Of course, Digital Dice with Ron Chuckett on Spreaker or wherever fine podcasts can be listened to. Says, this is actually pretty cool. It is wicked fun. This is wicked fun. I like this. I don't care about... I mean, I'm going to try to trade to get Esposito, and that's about it. So 2-1, Buffalo, 3.06 to play in the first period. Rodgers and Perot. I wish the names were a little bigger, and maybe you can make them bigger. Dump and chase. Whalers will get there first. Roberts has it. Whalers down by one. Remember, they're 3-0. and The Sabres are 1-2. and Roberts, uh, I think, yeah. 
He's going to wait. I don't like... You can see the lines here. So he's going to wait. Roberts is going to wait. Plays it behind the net. Now sends the pass, a tight pass, to Mark Howe. Howe's going to pass to Stoughton. Stoughton, hopefully, is going to wait just a bit. And maybe we get Rogers to come right in the middle. And you can see we got that middle. And maybe we can slide it to Bennett. But let's try to wait here. I like to do this. Where's the wait? Wait. Looks like a line change. Carroll comes on. Stoughton taking the puck. Now it's dump and chase. God, I hate dump and chase. Sabres get there first. Sabres outlet pass. And here comes Selling. Selling will dump and chase now for the Sabres. Hodgson gets to the puck first. And it looks like a possible line change for the Sabres with 2.12 to play in the first period. You can No, you load all the little guys in at once, but there's some mistakes that you have to fix. And uh, one of them was Chicago spelled wrong. The Blackhawks is one word. They made it two. Um, and the older teams, you have to watch the spellings. So, but uh, for the, the new season, they're all loaded in properly, except the Blackhawks. Again, you have to change the name. They did Blackhawks two words. It's one word. So Hodgson with the puck. He has two defenders. We're going to go pass. And again, he's a little difficult to coach. So you know what? Let's let him make the choice. He still sends a nice pass out to Stoughton. Stoughton's a little difficult to coach, but I want him to skate. And he does. Gains the zone easily. Has a good angle. Two on two now. Sabre's getting back. Stoughton might shoot this puck. He takes it to the net. He's being harassed by Luchis and Ramsey. Now behind the net. And he loses the puck. They freeze it along the boards. And there's a faceoff in the Sabre zone. Keon kicked out of the faceoff circle for Howe. And the Sabres win it. McKengry playing it back to Peralt. Now out to Sh War Schultz. Schultz taking it down the middle. How harassing him. Whalers getting back on defense. Schultz really driving to that net. Schultz playing tough near the board. Someone clear him from that net. Oh boy, too much time with the puck. Sabres shot on Garrett. He makes the save. Did he freeze the puck? No, he doesn't. He slides the puck to Rick Hodgson dangerously close to the net. We're going to look for a breakout pass. Hodgson sends it to Keon. Keon, well, we want him to skate. He's quite coachable, so he'll skate. He's skating down center ice. He has Howe on the wing. He gains the zone. Howe waits. Now Howe's still on the wing. Keon being harassed. Keon might take a shot here. Dump pass to Filipov. Filipov is somewhat coachable. I want him to pass. He sends it back to Keon. Keon point blank. Shoots. Saved by Edwards. Sabres control. Lucic. Schofield. McCarrigy. I can't read the name. Shot on um, Garrett. Save. Rebound goes to Howe. 16 seconds left in the first period. 2-1 Sabres. He's going to go for a quick outlet pass. Stoughton. Stoughton's going to need to skate like a madman. Nine, eight, seven. Stoughton put a shot on net. He does. Oh, just wide of Edwards. And that's the end of the first period. Oh, he was just wide of Edwards. That looked like it could have been an equalizer. Now it says, do you want to have... Uh, you shouldn't be confused. about. You can like type in a message if someone's confused about their role. No, 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 and no. And more no. Okay. Well, let's quickly go to the box score. Rodgers, that's his ninth goal of the year. And this is only the fourth game. He has been in fuego. Assisted by Blaine Stoughton, his ninth, and Bill Bennett, his fifth. Again, the Whalers are 3-0. and The Sabres are 1-2. and Sabres would score the, score the next two goals. Uh, Peralt and Ramsey. Ramsey was unassisted, I believe. Yeah, unassisted. And Peralt was assisted by Mick. Kegney, McKegney and Height. Gordy Roberts, two minutes for interference. McKegney. 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 Thank you. It's tough for me to see the names, but yeah, McKegney. Uncle Dave Gardner's helping me with pronunciations. Back to the game and the second period. Let's take a sip of water. 2 1 Sabres. Oh no, our winning streak could be all over. Still a lot of hockey to play. Face off for the second period. Keon and Peralt. Keon wins it, sends the puck 
to Mark Howe. Mark Howe is going to wait a bit. Nope, he quickly plays it to Gordy. Gordy will skate. Gordy does his thing. Gordy Howe skates it in, being harassed by two Sabres defenders. Now Howe sends a beautiful pass to Keon. Keon will shoot. No, it's blocked. Sabres have it. They lose the puck. Sloppy play at center ice. Whalers gain the puck. And they're going to play the wait. They need the Whaler players to come out of the zone as the puck is played back to Rick Lee. Lee will wait, and the Whalers will re regroup. All the Whalers are out of the zone. And a beautiful pass just as Gordy Howe comes out of the zone. Key sends him the pass. Gordy Howe is going to skate it in. Gordy Howe breaking in on Edwards. Gordy Howe shoots wide of Edwards, but gets the rebound near the boards. Battle along the boards. Howe wins it. Plays it back to his son, Mark Howe. And there's a battle in front of the boards. Peralt and somebody else. I can't tell who. You know what, Mark Howe? We want you to shoot. Hopefully he does. Blocked. Shot doesn't get through. Sabres are in possession. And it's Martin with the breakout. Puts a shot. And up and over the glass. Face off in the Whalers zone. No. No. Face off will go into the... Excuse me. Face off. So a quick play. Could have been icing. I don't know. But a face off in the Sabres zone. Rogers wins the face off. Puck goes to Blaine Stoughton. So Blaine Stoughton. Where the hell's Blaine Stoughton? Stoughton's right here. Being well defended by two Sabres. Uh, he's going to pass. Plays it to Al Sims. We're all bunched up. Sims is going to pass. Hopefully we get it to Howe. Nope, he plays it near the boards and Bennett. Bennett will pass. Plays it back to Sims. We're gaining like soccer. We want some space. I want to get it to Howe. Now they play it to Mark Howe. Now hopefully we can get it to Stoughton because Edwards, we have Rodgers. I like to go Stoughton. Maybe we get it to Rodgers. Pass. Rodgers shoots. Yes! And Rodgers taps it in for goal number 10. And the Whalers have tied it at two. Mike Rodgers has been in fuego in these first four games. Ten goals. Unbelievable. What a beautiful pass. Seems to how how waited patiently for that opening as Rodgers found that space in front of the net and he taps it in past a bewildered Edwards. 2-2, two, two, how do you do? Hockey Unreal is here in Buffalo. Check out that wonderful, wonderful card and dice hockey channel. And also, Rob Gallimore. Hope all is well, my friend. Yep, it, the names on the players are very cool, but I, w I I don't I have to see if I can make I don't think I can make them bigger. It's very difficult for me to see them, but at least there's names. And again, I like to thank greatly Christopher Slovic. Check out his videos on this game; it'll help you a lot. Listen to them, watch them. Uh, on his last live or the prior to last live video, I asked questions. I was at work, but I was able to ask some questions, and he answered how I'm supposed to do a couple of things. He helped me get the names. He helped me fix the Chicago Blackhawks. So, Christopher Slovak, thank you very much. D. Scott Howard's here. The Goat Whisperer. So, it's 2-2. Rodgers, again, he's been insane. Let's go to the box score. Let's go. Can we go to the box score? No. Uh, play. Box score. Okay. Rodgers, that's his 10th goal of the season. We're only four games in. This is our fourth game. I'm loving the chalkboard. This is so much fun to me. All right, face-off at center ice. Did we win the face-off? I believe we did. So we're in control. Oh, play. Here we go. Here's the face-off. We won the face-off. Blaine Stoughton gets the puck. We're going to play wait. Stoughton, back and forth. Now he loses it. Sloppy play. Sabres have it. Sabres break out to Dudley. Dudley, defended by Howe, sends it. Beautiful pass to Murdoch. And they try to play dump and chase, but the puck goes up and over the glass. Face off just outside the Whalers' zone. 
Faceoff is won by the Whalers. Harold Filipov in possession of the puck. He's going to skate. Filipov coming down the wing. Gare guarding him. So is Stewart. <coughs> Filipov breaking towards the net. He has Keon. Now he skates a circle. Sends it out towards a blue line. And Marty Ha. We've got Keon and we have Gordy. Let's go pass. Pass goes to Father Gordy. Anytime Gordy gets the puck in that close, he's going to shoot. Save. No tapping. Sabres look to break out. Gare has it. Gare gaining speed. And now the Sabres go to that horrible dump and chase. That never works. Winning the puck along the boards is Marty Howe. Howe's looking for a breakout pass to his father. He sends it to Gordy. Gordy's going to skate. Here comes Gordy down the wing. Old man Gordy picking up speed. Crosses the red line. Gains the Sabres zone. He's harassed by two Sabres defenders. Ramsey and Schofield. Gordy goes into a spin move. Gordy still beautiful puck handling. Sends it back to... Dave DeBolt, who's still being a crybaby about his number. And DeBolt will shoot. Nope, he plays it back to Mark Howe. Howe. Oh, we have Carroll. I like Carroll. Can we get the pass again? Hopefully Howe sees that and sends the pass to Carroll. Nope, sends it to DeBolt. DeBolt to Carroll. Carroll, height defending. He's getting in front of Carroll. Right, let's see if we can pass it to old man Gordy. Nope, plays it back to DeBolt, who's being tightly guarded by Lucic. Luch, can DeBolt get the pass to Howe? Yes, he does. Gordy's going to shoot. Save by Edwards. Sabres get the puck out to the wing. Gare flying down the wing. Gains the Whaler zone. Puts a shot on Edwards. Rebound goes to Hodgson. 16-21 to play in the second period. We're knotted at two. All right, Hodgson's a little difficult to coach, so he's fairly unlikely to listen to anything I say. Let's go pass anyway. At least, Oh, nice pass to Carroll. Carroll, somewhat coachable, more likely to listen. Carroll, no, he's a decent skater. His puck handling's 15. That's pretty good. I believe the rating's 0 through 20, so 15's pretty good. Uh, it looks like we have a little line change. You can see Howe pointing towards the bench. And it looks like Gordy, both Howes are going towards the bench. So let's click on wait. Carroll plays it back. Here's the line change. Kozak comes on the ice. Kozak now in possession. We're going to wait some more. Now Kozak plays it back to Hodgson. Hodgson is going to skate, but he's going to skate it around. He's not going to listen to us. Whalers. Hodgson's being harassed. He needs to get rid of this puck. Whalers finally get out of their zone in Carroll. But what we did with the waiting is we've created space. We've created space. This is like soccer. Space is good. So now, Carroll, we want him to skate. And Carroll skates down the wing. Picks up speed. Gains this Buffalo Sabres zone. Beautiful long pass to the other wing to Kozak. Kozak, tough angle. Let's look at the shot now. Accuracy is 14. Range is 5. So his range from here is not good. Uh, 55 from the net. He's going to wait. Let's get some more Whalers into the zone, hopefully. Kozak sends the pass to D-Bolt. Again, you can see the line change. You can see Carroll's going back off to the bench. Sims and somebody else are coming on. So he sends it to D-Bolt. We're going to want D-Bolt to wait. D-Bolt does wait, sends it back to Kozak. So we're playing a little keep away now as we have a Whaler line change. And again, we're going to go play wait. Kozak doing a good job of puck handling. Sends it back to Debolt. Let's continue to wait. The more you do this, though, the chance of them stealing the puck becomes greater. Debolt being harassed by Smith. As Murdoch breaks towards Sims, the pass gets to Al Sims. Sims, we need to get these guys into this zone. Let's wait again. Sims in a battle with Murdoch. Murdoch wins the puck. Sends it to Smith. Now the Sabres are going with a line change. They play it back. Now they play it back up to Murdoch. Murdoch dump and chase is the horrible, horrible thing in these games. Al Sims has it quickly. Sends it out to Antonovic. I think the Sabres were in a line change. That's why they went dump and chase there. Antonovic has it. Antonovic let's catch him in the line change. He's going to skate. Come on, Antonovic. Antonovic crosses the red line. Gains the Sabres zone. Mike Rogers is with him. Rogers with 10 goals on the season. Antonovic being harassed by Stewart and Lucic. Battling, battling. The Sabres trying to get that puck from Antonovic. 
Antonovich, good puck handling right now. He needs to get rid of the puck. He's going to lose it. Now it's Stewart banging away with the stick at Antonovich. Lacroix. Oh! Slides the pass through the crease. And Kozak, it's a tough angle. He's going to try to shoot, though. Yeah! Did, oh! What did we do? Hit the post? No! Lacroix shoots! And he can't bang it in. Unbelievable. Whalers with excellent opportunity there. Cannot bang it in. Breakout by Ramsey. Ramsey down the wing for the Sabres. Puts the shot wide of Edwards. Racing to the puck is Mark Howe. 13-31 to play in the second period. We're knotted at two. Howe will skate. He's an excellent skater and stick handler. Howe starts to bring it up out of the zone. Head up hits Bill Bennett. Bennett will skate, hopefully. And that's just what Bill Bennett does. Cross center ice. Now dump and chase. Looks like there's a line change for the Whalers. Sabres come away with it. Schofield, head up for the Sabres. Now back a bit. Sends the pass to the middle. Blaine Stout is letting a lot of opponents get around him. Do you want to have him play more conservatively? Continue playing as he's been. Blaine Stout is oh so in-game feedback. Well, do we want Blaine Stout to play more conservatively? <sighs> yes, I will do that. Let him play a little more conservatively and continue to play. Saber send the puck out to McKig Mc McKigney. McKigney breaking towards the net. Lee trying to defend him. Shot, save, or blocked. Lee has the puck, but there's a lot of traffic in front of that net. We're in, uh, skate. He's going to try to skate it out, and Lee does. Good job by Lee. McKegney harassing him. McKegney steals the puck. McKegney shoot, save by Garrett. Garrett sends the puck back to Lee. Lee skating it up. Sends it quickly to Bill Bennett. Bennett looking to skate it down the Whalers zone. He does. He crosses center ice. Lucic getting back along with someone else who I can't read the name. Bennett just continues to press forward. He's being harassed by two Sabres. He's in the corner. There's a battle in the corner. He's got to get rid of this puck. They're trying to freeze up the puck here. Sabres trying to freeze up that puck or get away from Bennett. Bennett continues to battle. A lot of stick handling there. Bennett, Bennett's in trouble. Get rid of the puck, Bill. Get rid of the puck, Bill. Bill passed the puck. Bill, oh boy. they really pounding away on him on the boards. Now he sends a beautiful pass to the bolt. Can he put the Whalers ahead? Yes! Goal, DeBolt! What a job by Bill Bennett just battling away along the boards. He would not give up that puck. The Sabres were whacking away at Bennett. And he puts an unbelievable pass on the stick of Dave DeBolt, who puts goal number three Pass the Sabres, goalie Edwards, and the Whalers. And you can hear Brass Bonanza not playing at the Hartford Civic Center because they are playing in the Springfield, Massachusetts Civic Center at this point in time. You can hear it all the way from Springfield, Massachusetts in Hartford, Connecticut. Brass Bonanza. The third goal is scored here by the Whalers in Buffalo, and Edwards doesn't know what hit him. The Whalers are just outstanding. Assist by Bill Bennett, who was tremendous along the boards. Continued to battle, battle. He couldn't get the puck away from him. What a pass by Bennett to the ball. 3-2 Whalers. Lee with the other assist. 11.33 to play in the second period. Face off center ice. Lacroix and Peralt. And Mike Antonovich, two-minute minor, unsportsmanlike conduct. He, a, little, a few choice words and some pushing. Sabres go on the power play. They had a horrible power play last time as they had 4,000 icing somehow. I would have fired the coach right after that. Rodgers and Peralt. Sabres win the faceoff. Quick shot on Garrett. He makes the save. They've put two past Garrett so far. Garrett freezes the puck. Faceoff in the Whalers zone. Rodgers kicked out of the faceoff circle. Here comes Stoughton to battle Peralt. Sabres win it. Another quick shot on Garrett and another save. Again, the puck now goes out to Stoughton. 
So Garrett quickly plays it to Stoughton. Stoughton try a little pass to Rogers. Rogers will skate as we try to kill some penalty time. Rogers skating up ice shorthanded. Rogers with 10 goals on the year. Rogers unafraid. He is killing clock here. Rogers loses the puck to Peral. Now the Sabres with a breakout three on two. Oh, a lot of space here. Whalers trying to frantically get back. I think that's Murda. I can't read whose name that is. Beautiful pass to Peralt, but he's cut off going to the net. Good job by Howe. I think that's Marty Howe. Oh, no. Gare has it, but he's being harassed by Marty Howe. And Marty Howe steals the puck. Unbelievable. What a job by Marty Howe. 41 seconds left. Let's go shorthanded pass. Stoughton has it. He's going to skate. Again, trying to kill clock here. Good job by Stoughton as he takes it. Oh, now he'll dump it in, and the Whalers will get back. 23 seconds. Line change for both teams on the power play. Sabres had a better power play, at least, but they still haven't scored. 3-2 two, two Whalers. Sabres closing moments of the power play. It's Murdoch being harassed by Roberts. Murdoch again. Now teams at full strength. Murdoch crashing towards the net. Little pass to Lucic. Lucic passes. Shot saved by Garrett. I believe the shot was by uh, McKechnie. And Garrett makes another save. Did he freeze the puck with under 10 minutes to play in the second period? No, he plays a quick little pass to Roberts. Now, the Whalers have a chance for a big breakout if we can get it to Antonovic, who's out of the box. Sends it to Kozak. You can see Ramsey trying to get over frantically. You can see the air. You can see the line. He's got to get over here. Now Kozak needs to get this pass, hopefully, to Antonovic. And he does. Antonovic will fly up the ice. Come on, Antonovic. Ramsey does get back to cut the angle. Antonovic gains his own. Whalers looking for goal number four with under nine to play in the second period. Antonovic being harassed by Ramsey and McKegney. Antonovic now battling. He's trying to set up something. Whalers go to a freaking line change at the worst time. And poor Antonovich is being battered, but contains, maintains that now he loses the puck. McKegney with the breakout. Sabres down by a goal. McKegney picking up speed on the wing. McKegney. How on McKegney? McKegney continues to come forward. Looking for Lucic. Someone get Lucic. He's right in front of the net. Get him. Get him. Ooh, what a play by Howe. McKegney was trying to get that pass to Lucic, it looks. And Marty, Mark Howe has it. Mark Howe sends it to DeBolt. DeBolt sends it to Carroll. Carroll looking to skate up ice. And he does. Carroll gaining speed. Crosses center ice. Gains the Sabre zone. Carroll slides between two defenders. Now he needs to dump the pass to DeBolt. DeBolt. Is going to try to get a tough shot off. Saved by Edwards. Rebound goes to the Sabres. Good passing. They're back and forth. Sabres with the breakout. Sabres with the breakout. Oh, but again, Johnny on the spot. This time it's Gordy Howe. Oh, they're trying to get a give and go to Peralt. As Martin dumped it back to Peralt. And Peralt was probably going to try to get to the streaking Martin. But old man Gordy, a little too smart for that. So Howe has the pickoff, as we say, and now Howe skates a circle. Howe waiting, and now Gordy Howe advances. Gordy Howe, cross the Sabres blue line, sends a beautiful pass to Carroll. Carroll to shoot. Oh, wide of Edwards. Sabres get the puck behind the net. A long outlet pass to Gare. Dump and chase. Looks like a line change. Whalers have it. It's Filipov. Filipov will wait. Ooh, you know what? No, he won't. No, he won't. Um, let's see if we can... We're going to go pass. What a long pass! He hit... What a pass! He hits Gordy Howe! And I think then you could not have a two-line pass. So he hits Howe before the red line. Gordy could break in alone. Come on, Gordy! Come on, Gordy! Gordy breaking in alone! Shoot! Save by Edwards! And he freezes the puck. Perot, Not Perot. Okay. Jaber, is it Gilbert? Perot, 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 potato, potato. Oh, Gordy Howe broke in alone, but Edwards stoned him. Whalers, Rogers, Perot, Roger, Perot. Excuse me, Rogers wins the faceoff. Faceoff goes to Marty Howe. Should we take a quick shot here? You know what? 
Range 14. He's going to take a quick shot off the faceoff. Oh, it gets through. Rebound. Bill Bennett cannot poke it past Edwards. Two great save by Edwards. Keeps the lead. For, keeps the... Uh, it's still 3-2. Great, two great saves. I couldn't think of the phrase I wanted to use. Quick shot on Garrett. He makes the save, but a really big job. Gilbert, that's it. Thank you. Gilbert, like Jill Gilbert, the goalie for the Bruins. Or is that Jill Gilbert? So Edwards really kept, at that moment, the Sabres in the game. He stoned the Whalers twice. Garrett makes a save. Did he freeze the puck? No, he doesn't. Doesn't he plays it quickly out to Roberts with 6:07 left in the period? Roberts passes to Bennett, who will skate it up. Oh, we get it! Did he send it? No, he sends it way over to Stoughton. We're gonna want Stoughton to skate, and let's get Mike Rogers in that zone. Rogers in the center. Stoughton dump the pass to Rogers. He's there. Pass it to Rogers. Pass it to Rogers. Oh, Stoughton does it. Rogers banging away in the front of the net. Stoughton takes it to the boards, being harassed by Ramsey. Rogers battling Stewart in front of Edwards. A lot of traffic in front of Edwards. Now they're trying to get the puck away from Stoughton. Stoughton's got to get rid of this puck. He shoots. Rogers gets the rebound. Can he poke it past Edwards for goal number 11? No, Edwards again. Rogers cannot control the puck. Puck goes out to Selling. Selling takes it into the Whaler zone. Are they going to play dump and chase? No, he loses the puck. Antonovich with a good little poke check. And Marty Howe comes away with the puck. Slides it back to Antonovich. Antonovich plays it back towards Hodgson. Hodgson plays it to Marty Howe. Marty Howe out to the wing and Stoughton. Excellent puck movement by the Whalers. Stoughton will look to skate it down the wing. And he does try to get an opening for Rodgers. Rodgers looks like he's going off. Yet line change. So he's... Stoughton will just try to control the puck. Beautiful pass to Markow. Markow's going to shoot. Saved by Edwards. Quick outlet. Sabres. Now the puck goes to Dudley. Sabres. Dudley to Ramsey. Ramsey loses the puck to Rick Lee. Excellent job by Rick Lee. Another good little poke with the stick. And he gets the puck. Lee will try to hopefully... That's a tough angle. We're going to play weight, though that's dangerous in your own end. And instead, he slides the puck to Kozak, so that's fine with me. Kozak, not the best skater. We'll let him make his own choice. He's going to skate it out of the zone. I'm happy with that. Skates it across mid-ice, continues. Now plays it back towards Keon. Keon will have to wait because we don't want Kozak to get in that zone first wait so Keon takes it into the zone gives it back to Kozak Kozak hopefully a give and go to Keon nope he sends it to Filipov Filipov now to Keon Keon what's his shot range six you know what let's take a shot on that maybe we get a rebound instead he does not shoot he plays it back to Don Kozak who's being tightly guarded by Ramsey Let's go wait. Slides it to Filipov. Let's play wait again. Keon. He's got a little better look here. Let's have him skate. He's breaking towards the net, being harassed by Lucic. Lucic slows him up. Keon looking for some help. He gets it to Filipov, but Filipov being tightly guarded. I think if we click pass, hopefully he sends it back to Sims. He doesn't. He sends it to Keon. Oh, Keon! We might be able to beat Edwards glove side. Keon's going to shoot. Save. Rebound goes out to the Sabres. Sabres look for the breakout. Long pass to Dudley. Dudley crosses the red line. Gains the... No, nope, plays it back. Plays it back. As there's a line change. And now I think that's offsides. And it is. Offsides on the Sabres. Under three to play. Sabres win the faceoff. Quick shot on Garrett. Garrett makes the save. 3-2 Whalers. Did he freeze the puck? No, he doesn't. He plays it out to Howe. And that's Gordy Howe. Gordy Howe will skate. Old man Gordy zigging and zagging. Out there with Howe is Lacroix. And Antonovich. Howe gains his own. Lacroix to his left. Antonovich to his far left. Howe skates between defenders. 
Sends a beautiful pass to Lacroix. He's going to shoot. Saved by Edwards. Rebound to Antonovich. He'll try to poke it past Edwards. And he can't. And Edwards freezes the puck. Whalers putting a lot of pressure on the Sabres. Face off one by the Whalers. Puck goes to Kozak. Kozak will pass. Sends it out to Carroll. Carroll, tough angle there. Carroll plays it back out to Lee. Lee has a little bit of room here. Debalt, you can see the red line. He is breaking towards the net. We're going to click pass and hopefully hit Debalt breaking towards the net. Nope, they played it to Sims. Sims sends it to Debalt. Debalt will shoot. Oh, he missed the net or he hit the post. Kozak gets the puck for the Whalers. He shoots. Saves. Did, yes! It squeezes through. And the Whalers get goal number four. Johnny on the spot. Don Kozak assisted by Dave DeBolt and Al Sims. The puck squeezed through the pads of Edwards and into the back and just trickled into the back of the net. But it is a goal nonetheless. 4-2. Whalers looking to go 4-0 in this early season. 159 left in the second period. The Whalers showing their dominance as they hunt Sabres. Sabres win the faceoff. Quick shot on Garrett. He makes the save. Plays it out to Lee. Lee will skate it up a bit. Now sends the pass to Lacroix. Lacroix hopefully will skate it up. He does. Right down the center of the zone. Lacroix breaking in on Edwards. Lacroix now being defended by Perrault. Sends it to Kozak. Kozak will wait as he'll skate a circle. Now he sends it to Lacroix. Lacroix in beautiful spot. He shoots. Saved by Edwards. Rebound. Sabres. Sabres trying to break it out. Quick passes. Martin on the wing. Martin flying down the ring. Guarded by Lee. And Lee with a nice little poke check and comes away with the puck. 114 left in the second period. Lee. Beautiful outlet pass to Kozak. He should be breaking in all alone on Edwards. And he's looking for goal number two. And he's denied by Edwards. Martin now has the puck on the wing for the Sabres. Sabres coming down ice. Martin, 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 looking, looking, looking for some help. Whalers with stifling and stiffening defense. And the puck is froze along the boards. Face off in the Whalers zone. 42 seconds left. Keon wins the face off. Puck played back to Hodgson. Hodgson will wait. 4-2 lead. Hodgson goes behind the net. Hodgson continues to wait as the clock goes tick, tick, tick. We don't care. Under 20 seconds to play. Hodgson just holding the puck. That's beautiful. Just hold that puck, son. That's all we want. And that will end the second period as the Sabres do not come forth to try to get the puck away from Hodgson. 4-2 Whalers. And no. Keep playing the way you're playing. Do you want to try and convince Blaine Stoughton that he's been excessively care for defensively? And move his no, I think just keep playing the way he's playing. He was getting beat a little bit. Now he's not. Good job, Blaine Stone. Let's go to the box score in the final twenty minutes. So the Whalers in the second period get goals. They were down a uh, two-one after one, and then they got Rogers got his tenth goal. Assisted by Howe, his fourth, and Sims, his second. Then Dave DeBolt got his second. Assisted by Bennett, his sixth, and Rick Lee, his first. Kozak got his first. Assisted by Dave Dolbop. Dave DeBolt, his first, and Al Sims, his third. So 4-2 Whalers. And the Whalers have been pretty physical. Gordy Roberts and Mike Antonovich have both been in the box. 20 more minutes of hockey. Whalers looking to go to 4-0 here in Buffalo. Buffalo trying to get back to 500. Whalers hunting Bison third period here's the face off at center ice whalers win it the puck goes to marty howe marty howe will wait skates a little loop sends it to antonovich antonovich will skate it in hopefully and he does he skates it into the sabers zone antonovich has lacroix behind him and kozak way off to the wing he takes it towards the boards being harassed by height plays it back to roberts gear on roberts as Lacroix battling in front of the net with Schofield. You know what? Let's see if we can get a shot on that traffic. Yes, but it's blocked. Sabres have the puck in its gear. Gear sends it to Martin, plays it back to height. Oh, quick movement and back. Wow, it's a breakout by the Sabres. Martin breaking in. Oh, oh the puck went behind the net. 
Oh, it beat Edwards, but it's behind the net. No goal. Roberts gets the puck. Quick outlet pass to Kozak. Yes, I want to be very careful. Micromanagement. I love it. <laughs> As I have hockey and real dumbfounded in the chat. It's my way of playing hockey. It's not good, but we're winning. Somehow we're winning. And we're doing it with lots of goals. It's the Al Red Sox fan way of playing hockey. So Kozak will skate. He'll take it out towards the wing, hopefully. No, he doesn't. Coming down center ice. Now he picks up speed. Ah, oh, dump and chase. Line change. Line change. That's why they did dump and chase. So the Sabres down by two. Big outlet pass to the wing and ceiling. Ceiling. How playing ceiling. Ceiling breaking towards the net. Now he's denied. Good job by Howe. Back to... Oh, Sabres looking to put a shot on. Ramsey has it. Oh, a lot of traffic there. Ramsey gets the puck from behind the net. Sabres putting a lot of pressure in the Whaler zone. And finally, a battle in front of the net. The puck is loose. Mike Rogers has it. Will Rogers skate away from the, sc the scrum? Yeah. Oh, great outlet pass to Stoughton. Come on, Stoughton. Take it down the wing. We're letting you play literally no defense. Stoughton with fresh legs flying up ice. Stoughton. Ramsey on Stoughton. Stoughton cutting towards the net. Now Ramsey stops him. Stoughton being double teamed. Puts a shot on. Save by Edwards and a faceoff. Keon and Perot. Sabres win it. Stewart in possession. Stewart sends it out to Martin on the wing. Martin skating quickly. Howe trying to check him into the boards. Martin will not have none of it, but now Martin's stopped. Martin sends a beautiful pass to Perot. Perot trying to spin and shoot, but he has too many Whaler defenders. Plays it back towards Martin. Martin being harassed near the boards. Puck behind the net and froze. Face off in the Whaler zone. Lacroix and Smith. Sabres win it. Shot blocked. Smith in possession. Sends it out to Murdoch. Murdoch battling along the boards with Howe. Who has the puck? I don't even know. Oh, it's Dudley Lore pushing the screen. Plays it back. Now over to Murdoch. Murdoch. They're just playing keep away from the Whalers. Shot on net. Save. Um, by Garrett. Puck bounces to Mark Howe. Howe is going to try to pass. Look to Antonovich. Ooh. Skate Antonovich. Antonovich plays it to Lacroix. Skate Lacroix. Lacroix, cross center ice, cuts it towards, oh, dump and chase, looks like a line change, and it is. But the Sabres have an opportunity, quick pass to Dudley, Dudley crossed the red line, Dudley gains the blue, zone, blue line, he's in the Whalers zone, Dudley waiting for some help, he has Smith in the middle, and Gar off to the other, ooh, plays it back to Schofield, shot, save, puck is loose, but Sims has it, as Gar was frantically poking away for the Sabres, Sims a quick outlet pass to Lacroix. Lacroix waits a bit. Now he plays it, skates back a bit. Sends it to Gordy Howe. Gordy Howe will skate. Old man Gordy skating down the center of the ice. Gordy continues to crash towards the net. There is no stopping old man Gordy. Gordy showing tremendous power. Mr. Hockey putting pressure on the Sabres in their zone. Now behind the net. And they're just banging away. Howe. Comes around the net. Now back behind the net. Sends the pass out to his son, Mark. He's got a pretty decent angle. He'll shoot from distance. Oh, actually, he passes. I clicked the wrong button. He sends it to Gordy. Can Gordy tap it in? Oh, he missed. Gordy, how missed. Sabres have the rebound. And now, Gare comes racing down the wing. Sabres down by two. Shot on Garrett. Another shot on Garrett. Two beautiful saves. And finally, Mark Howe wins the puck in the Whalers' zone. Uh, pass. Sends it to Bennett. Pass. Sends it to Keon. Skate, Keon. And Keon gets in at center ice of the Sabres' zone. Lucic on him. Keon plays it back to Bennett. The angle's not there, but you know what? Let's take the shot. He misses a shot wide. Battle for the puck goes to the Sabres. Selling plays it to the other wing to Ramsey. Back to, I can't read who that is, but he's streaking down the ice. Shot saved by Garrett. Rebound goes to Lee. Lucic pushing, putting pressure on Lee. 
Lee will try to hopefully get the pass to Blaine Stoughton. Nope, he plays it to Sims. Sims plays it to Keon. Keon plays it back to Lee. Whaler's trying to create space. Now it goes to Stoughton. Ramsey trying to cut the angle. Can Stoughton get around him? Ramsey decides to retreat. Stoughton gains the zone. He needs some help. He's waiting for some Whaler players. And it looks like it was a line change. Stoughton killing time. Beautiful pass to Antonovic. Antonovic will wait. Whalers will try to set up in better position. Oh, what a pass to Stoughton. Can Stoughton get the Whalers? Goal number five. Yes! Blaine Stoughton beats Edwards stick high. And it is 5-2 Hartford. The Whalers juggernaut of an opening uh opening the games, the first four games of this season have been unbelievable. They have just been a juggernaut. Spit it out, Al. So that is Blaine Stoughton's goal, assisted by Mike Antonovich and Rick Lee. 5-2 Whalers. There is no stopping the Hartford Whalers as they continue to harpoon bison. And boy, does bison meat taste good. So the Whalers just really beating on the Sabres. There's no answer by the Buffalo Sabres. That is Stoughton's second goal of the season. Second assist for Antonovich and second assist for Rick Lee. Back to the game with 12.40 to play. Face-off won by the Sabres. Murdoch plays it back to Schofield. Schofield, ooh, sends it to Murdoch. Quick shot on Garrett. Garrett with another save. And he plays it out to Mark Howe. Howe will try to hopefully get a pass to... Oh, he plays it short to Hodges. And then we got some opportunities here. Let's have Hodges wait. Hodges waits a bit. Now sends it out to Bennett. That's where we wanted to get it. Bennett will skate. Skate, Bennett. Skate. Bennett skating down the wing. Height trying to cut the angle. Height now harassing Bennett. Bennett playing towards the net. But Height forcing him towards the boards. Beautiful pass to Rogers. Poke it in, Rogers. Yes! Yes, Mike Rogers, unbelievable. Another beautiful pass by Bennett. He did it earlier in the game, and Mike Rogers gets his second goal of the game. I believe it's his 11th for the season, and the Whalers are up 6-2. There is no stopping this juggernaut. The Hartford Whalers, Whalers playing in the spring at home games in the Springfield, Massachusetts Civic Center because the Hartford Civic Center uh, roof collapsed. Bennett and Hodgson on the assist. Unbelievable. Let's go to the box score. Mike Rogers with 11 goals now. Bennett with his seventh assist. Hodgson with his third. The Whalers have really created this offense of create space. Get the puck to Mike Rogers. It's brilliant. It's brilliant, I'm telling you. Here we go. Here's the faceoff. Whalers win it. Whalers just, oh, man, the Whalers are just romping. The Whalers. Who has the puck? It doesn't matter. Blaine Stoughton has the puck. Stoughton will skate. He skates it into the zone. There is no... Oh, he loses the puck. He's going to hear about that. Ramsey with the puck. Sabres down by four goals with under 12 to play. Ramsey still with the puck. Skating around. Plays it back towards the blue line. Shot on Garrett. Garrett has been outstanding. Outstanding. Outstanding, excuse me, between the pipes. Another save. And Garrett will freeze the puck face off in the Whalers zone. Keon and Perot. Keon wins the face off. Puck is poked to Gordy Roberts. Roberts will pass. Roberts plays it back to Keon. Keon plays it. Oh, they lose the puck. Sloppy play. And then some quick passing and a shot on Garrett and another save by the Whaler goaltender. Garrett freezes the puck and yet another faceoff. Rogers and Smith. Rogers wins the faceoff for Hartford. The puck goes bouncing to Al Sims. Sims will try to skate it out. He waits a bit. Now Sims looking. Sends it to Mike Rogers. Rogers will skate. He has two goals. Rogers picking up ahead of speed. Rogers gains the zone. Rogers breaking in. He has Bennett on the wing. Rogers plays it back to Rick Lee. 
Ooh, we have two good options here. Hopefully Lee, if he sends it to Stout, and we're going to click pass, and maybe he sends it to Rogers. But maybe he can thread the needle to Bennett. And that side is wide open. So let's click pass. Nope, he sends it to Sims. Sims sends it back to Lee. Rogers still breaking towards the net. There's the pass to Stoughton. Stoughton doesn't really have a good angle. Let's let him make his own choice. Stoughton plays. Oh, he played it back to Lee. Schultz picked his pocket. Sabres need to score quickly. Under 10 to play. Schultz bringing it down the wing. Lee skating back. And Lee with a poke check. He gets the puck back. Let's see if we can have a quick breakout. Nope. Plays it back to Sims. Looks like the Whalers are changing lines. Let's wait. Now Sims sends it. He didn't listen. He sends the long pass to Stoughton. Stoughton looks to skate it in. He picks up some speed, gains the blue line of the Sabres, being defended by Schofield. Stoughton skates around. He's got Lacroix in the center, now behind the net. Antonovich to the top. Plays it back to Mark Howe near the blue line. Hodgson coming in. Mark Howe's going to play a little waiting game. He didn't wait too long. He sent the pass back behind the net to Lacroix. Lacroix will pass. Lacroix sends it back out to Mark Howe. Howe will take the shot from there, hopefully. He shoots. Nope, he passed. Or was a bad shot. And again, Lacroix behind the net. Let's just wait. Let's set up a little better. Lacroix waiting. He loses the puck. No, there's a battle. And he loses the puck to Schofield. Sabres have it. Lacroix battling. Now an outlet pass to Dudley. Dudley racing down the wing. Sabres down by four. Back and forth they go. Good puck movement. Lucic sends it back. Oh, my God. Oh, wow. Excellent puck movement and a quick shot on Garrett. It was so fast I couldn't keep up. But Garrett makes the save. Under eight to play. Garrett plays it short to Mark Howe. Mark Howe will wait. Mark Howe plays it behind the net. Don't lose the puck, Mark. Now he plays it in the Whaler zone to Dave Keon. There's a lot of space here, but let's play pass. And hopefully they send it to Gordy Howe. Nope, because now he sends it to Gordy Howe, and Gordy Howe will skate. Mr. Hockey, Gordy Howe, skating around, killing time. Now dump and chase as the Whalers go for a line change. Quick outlet pass to Martin by the Sabres. Sabres need to score and score quickly. They're down 6-2. to two. Can they get four goals in under, almost be under seven minutes in a few moments? Gare with the puck. Shoots. Saved by Garrett. Garrett's been outstanding in net for the Whalers. He has given up two goals, but the Whalers have put six past a Civ like goalie named Edwards. Garrett plays it short to Sims. Sims passes it to Keon. Keon will let him make his own choice. He's going to skate it out of the zone now. Plays it back. Whalers line change. Stoughton just off the bench. He's in possession of the puck. And Stoughton will skate. Stoughton skates to center ice. Now gains the blue line for the Sabres. Plays it back towards Bennett. Bennett, uh, 13 accuracy, 6 range, 61. So let's, you know what? What the hell? Put a shot on that. Nope. He sly, He fakes the shot, slides it to Stoughton. Oh, Lord. I'm going to shoot from there. Oh, wide of Edwards. Edwards plays it up, and Sealing has it. And the Sabres go with the line change, so they dump it in. How in possession on the boards near the backboards, I guess you would call them. And let's see if we can play a pass to Stoughton, because that's a lot of space there. Nope, he played it to Keon. Keon then plays it to Stoughton. Oh, we got a lot of space. Skate, Stoughton, skate. Quickly, the Sabres get over to cut the angle, but Stoughton gains the Sabres zone. He has Antonovich. He slides the pass to Antonovich. Sealing and Smith looking to cut the angle of Antonovich. Antonovich shoots wide of Edwards. Battle for the puck is going to be won by Antonovich. And he puts it in! Unbelievable hustle by Antonovich. Mike Antonovich gets the Whalers' seventh goal, and Saber fans are leaving the building just like Elvis. 7 to 2, Hartford. Hartford. Antonovich with the goal. Blaine Stoughton 
And Dave Keon with the assist. There is no stopping the juggernaut known as the Hartford Whalers as they are on the verge of going 4-0 to start the 79-80 season. It doesn't matter that the Hartford Civic Center roof collapsed. They're now playing in the Springfield, Massachusetts Civic Center where they should have played for the rest of their life in New England. But no, they went back to Hartford. All righty. So 547 to play. Should we put Smith in goal? He's been a crybaby. How do I switch goalies? Let's see how do we do this. Let's go. I don't even know how to switch goalies. I want to put Smith in goal. Nah, you know what? The hell with that. Let's just play play. Alright. 547 to play. 7-2 Whalers. Buffalo just wants to get the hell out of this game. Oh! Oh, the puck is behind the net. They beat. They beat. Garrett stick side, but it was behind the net. Now Garrett recovers the puck. Garrett will play it to Dave DeBowl. He scored a goal today. DeBowl will pass it to Roger. Uh, Hodgson, excuse me. Hodgson plays it back to Mark Howe as Bennett and Rogers skate up ice. Howe. Sends it to Rogers in the center. And this is where Rogers likes to be. Looking for the hat trick. Rogers racing down ice. One against three. It's Rogers against the world. He plays it back to DeBolt. Why not? DeBolt shoots. No! He fakes the shot. Sends it to Rogers. Rogers looking for the hat trick. Save! And now there's a new goalie. A new goalie for. The, I don't know when they switch, but they switch goalies. Edwards is no longer in. Buffalo controls the puck under five to play. And the horrible dump and chase offense by the Sabres. Maybe that's why they're one and two. On the verge of being one and three. Roberts wins the puck along the backboards. Who the hell is that goalie now? Four. Um, who is the goalie now for the Sabres? Where's the goalies? Sop, uh, Suave. Edwards is out. He gave up six goals. Actually, Suave gave up the seventh goal. I did not know that. Suave. I don't know. Rico Suave. Serva. Maybe. All right. Roberts has it. Roberts will pass. He sends it to Keon in the middle. Keon will pass. He sends it to Filipov. Filipov will pass. And he sends it. To Gordie Howe. Gordie Howe will skate. Gordie Howe looking for a goal. Gordie Howe skates it in. Tremendous strength by Howe at this advanced age. Howe bang. Oh, Keon. Here comes a goal. Oh, my Lord. He plays it to Howe. Wrap around, Gordie. Yes! Gordie Howe! Gordie Howe! Gordie Howe! Gordie Howe! Gordie Howe! Gordie Howe on the wraparound! Unbelievable, unbelievable, unselfish play. They wanted Gordy to get the goal, and he did. And it's 8-2 to two Hartford, and the few fans left here in Buffalo are hurling crap at the Buffalo branch. And I literally mean crap, like monkeys would do at the zoo. So Gordy Howe, assisted by Dave Keon and Harold Filipoff, Bob Sauve. Thank you, Sauve. Hockey and Real says, thanks for that one. Now we just, now he just needs a fight. Oh, he got into a fight in the first game of the season, Gordy. Actually, it was an exhibition game. Wow, I wish there was replays. So, uh, 351 left. Let's let play. Let's go to box score. Gordy, how? That's his third goal of the season. Keon with his ninth assist. Filipov with his second. The Whalers are a juggernaut offense as we play this wonderful offense of create space. <laughs> I've simplified it for myself. Just create space. Get the puck to the open guy. Face-off won by the Sabres. Shot on Garrett. He makes the save. Garrett 
plays it to Sims. Sims passes to Kozak on the wing. Kozak to skate. Nope, he plays it back to Sims because he doesn't listen. Sims pass. Sends it to Debolt in the middle. Debolt hopefully will skate. He skates a bit. Picks up ahead of steam. Crosses center ice. Gains the Saber zone. 8-2 Whalers. Back to Kozak. You know what? Kozak looks to shoot. Fakes the shot. Sends it to Carroll. Carroll plays it back to Kozak. Kozak shoots. Save. Rebound. Sabres have a quick outlet pass to Ceiling. Ceiling being harassed. Shot on Garrett. Rebound goes to Lee. 2.59 to play. Whalers looking for two more goals. They want 10 goals. 10 goals. Pass. Pass, Lee. He's not listening. Oh, line change. Good job by Lee. Now the pass goes to Bill Bennett, who just came off the bench. Now he's on the ice. Bennett will wait as there's a line change. That makes sense to wait, right? Plays it back to Lee. As the Whalers happily play keep away from the Sabres. Now back to Bennett. Bennett skates up ice. He loses the puck. Oh, he's going to hear about that one. Pass is played to Martin, who shoots on Garrett. Garrett, as cool as the other side of the pillow, calmly makes the save. Plays it to Rick Lee. Lee plays it to Roberts. Roberts sends a pass to Stoughton. Stoughton looking to break in. As he has beat the defenders, he is behind the Sabres defense, but Ramsey gets back, cuts off the angle, plays it to Mike Ro Oh, God. Rogers looking for another goal. No, nope. he plays very unselfishly. Plays it to Stoughton. Stoughton passes back to Rogers. Rogers will pass back to Stoughton. Back to Rogers. Rogers to Stoughton. Stoughton shoots. Save. Puck is loose. Rebound goes to the Sabres. Outlet pass to Martin. Martin plays it to the center of the ice. But it's a sloppy pass. Sims can't handle it. Mark Howe comes away with it. 127 left. Howe will wait as the Whalers have to get out of the zone. He plays it back to Roberts. Whalers playing the wait keep away game. Roberts circles back, sends it to Howe. Howe will now skate forward. Howe just skating it back. Whalers just killing off time. Howe sends it to Kozak. Kozak, why not? Shoot. Kozak plays into the zone. He shoots. Saved by Edward, uh, uh, Sauve, excuse me. I think that's Sauve in that, right? Bennett wins the battle along the boards. 51 seconds left. Bennett will shoot. Why not? Nah, he didn't shoot. He passed to Hodgson. Hodgson will skate it up a bit. Back to Bennett. Whalers just killing time. Sabres want to get the hell out of, off the ice. Back to Rogers. Sends it to Don Kozak. Kozak will skate it in. And he does. 31 seconds left in this game. It is a romp for the Whalers here in Buffalo. DeBalt. DeBalt will shoot. Why not? No, he plays it to Kozak. Someone shoot for God's sake. Save! We don't get goal number nine. Sabres control under 10 seconds. Whalers laughing their ass off on their bench. Offsides on Buffalo. Poop continues to be hurled by the Sabre fans. A few Sabre fans left. They are hurling poop at the Sabre pay players to the delight of the Hartford bench as the players want to get back to the locker room. And here we go. This should end the game. Stoughton has the puck. And that is it, folks. The final score here in Buffalo, the visiting Hartford Whalers playing out of the Springfield, Massachusetts Civic Center, where they should have always played. Eight, the hometown Buffalo Sabres, well, they're bison meat. Two, unbelievable victory for our beloved Hartford Whalers. Lots of goals. Rogers with his ninth. Uh, Rogers with his tenth. Rogers with his 11th. He did get the hat trick. I just missed it. So Rogers gets another hat trick. Unbelievable. 8 to 2 Whalers. The two goals were scored. Buffalo actually had a brief 2 1 lead at the end of the first period. It was Perot and Ramsey. But then the Whalers Roberts, Rogers, DeBolt, Kozak. 
Stoughton, Rogers, Antonovich, and Gordie Howe got the final go when Dave Keon probably could have scored himself but put a beautiful pass to Howe who poked it past Save, who was in relief of a horrible Edwards. So the Whalers go to 4 0. The Sabres drop to 1 and 3. Cleve Baseball Fan 879 has joined us. You have just missed the Hartford Whalers absolutely annihilating the Buffalo Sabres 8 2. All right, return to the game and end game. Who's, who, let's see if anyone's a crybaby. I don't know. I don't care. We're winning. Let them cry all they want. Let's go continue. Uh, let's go here. All right. Canadians, Blackhawks. Let's see if I loaded the uniforms correctly. Let's just go view. And view game just for a little bit. Yeah. No. How come I loaded them right? They still didn't load up. See, they're still squares. I could have sworn I load them in correctly. Maybe I did the different season. Uh, see see how this it's still squares? Alright, I gotta check that again. I could have sworn I loaded the Blackhawks incorrectly. Warren says Rogers must be leading the league in goals. Yes. Right, so we're just gonna I just want to see if the Blackhawks um I don't know why they won't load up. I could have sworn I changed it to the right thing. Alright. Let's come on. Let's end this. Sim the game. All right. We got to fix that. And. Yes. Sim the game. Oh, no. The game's going to crash. Don't crash. We won 8 to 2. Oh, no. Ah, program's not going to respond. Oh, we might lose our 8-2 to two victory. That sucks. Well, we won 8-2. to two. You witnessed it. All right, control. Close program. Cancel. All right, we'll be... Hold on one moment. Hold on one moment. Hold on one moment. Let's get back into the game real quick. Uh, technical difficulties. Let's play. Hopefully, hopefully, we still have an 8-2. No matter what, we won 8-2. Yeah, Rogers will cry. Ah, oh, ah, oh, we lost the game. We lost the game. Ah. Oh. Oh, oh no you son of a gun just because of the stupid oh, we lost the game as Warren laughs alright well quick sim it watch they'll lose now they'll lose now oh that sucks alright let's just I was just seeing if the uh, sim 3-3 three, three tie oh that sucks after we won 8-2 Sim, 2-2. Two, two. Pittsburgh, 7-2 over the Kings. Oh, that sucks. 4-3. 2-1. Three. 3-2 two, two, Detroit. That sucks. Anyway, we had a lot of fun. I couldn't save. I couldn't... I, I should have... It, 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 I was... You're right. I should have saved before I clicked on that. Oh, well. We won 8-2. You saw it. Anyway, that sucks. There goes our undefeated season. <laughs> Let's see if um, Rogers scored any goals. How? Mm. Rogers got his ninth. And How got a goal. So it was 3 3. Ah, oh well. What can you do? And wait. And save current game. So there you have it. I'm still saying we won eight to two. 
Hockey Unreal said, feeling a bit under the weather. Thanks for this. It was fun. We scored eight goals. The computer couldn't take it. They hosed us out of a win. We ended up getting a tie. And like Dave Gardner says, save. And all I wanted to do. But who do we have up next? Los Angeles. Ooh, at the Springfield Civic Center. Look at that, folks. You think I'm lying. Where does it say they play? Where does it say they play? Right here. Can you see that? Can you see that? Springfield, Mass. That's the Civic Center, my friends. They played at the Springfield Civic Center until the uh, uh, Hartford Civic Center roof was fixed. I'm not lying about that. We should have kept them. <laughs> so, anyhow, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you to Warren, Hockey and Real. Check out that wonderful channel. Cleve Baseball Fan 879, our good friend Tim, check out his wonderful channel. Dave Gardner, check out his channel. And of course, Digital Dice on Spreaker or wherever fine podcasts can be listened to with his partner in crime, Uncle Ron Juckett, D. Scott Howard, the Goat Whisperer. We won 8 to 2. I don't care. We won't, You saw it. It's on video. We won 8 to 2. <laughs> um, game crashed. Rob Gallimore, thank you. Jason Cole, thank you. Hope everyone enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun. I do like playing that way. It's just very enjoyable. Um, so, health and happiness. Stay safe. Be smart. Merry Christmas. Happy holidays. Happy Hanukkah. Happy Kwanzaa. Happy whatever you celebrate. Treat people nice. And they should treat you nice also. Until next time, God bless. I love you all. You know what's coming, folks? Peace. See you again. Bye bye.